Hey guys, it's Into Thin Air. It's June 14th, 2017, 425 p.m. Um, channel Mr. MBB333 um, is doing some amazing work covering uh, the NASA flying telescope, uh, Sophia. And I hope he doesn't mind. I took a snapshot from his channel. He's been following the uh, flight path that it, it, it took. Um, I believe this was about three days ago. He just posted a video of the actual flight itself um, while talking about some earthquakes. Anyway, um, this is kind of a response video to him. I'm hoping he sees this. I caught something in a video from 2014 is the earliest I found it. And in this video, there's a quick one second part where it shows this guy holding this tablet and it shows a flight plan. Now this whole video is about uh, Sophia and again it's from 2014 uh, if anyone wants to look it up here's the clip um, I found another version of this video same video with some additions to it um, a little later than this one so the earliest one I could find was March 13th 2014 so when they made that video they were at least doing these flying patterns which seems to match what uh, Mr. MBB333 caught which is really cool because it seems that they are monitoring um, Yellowstone. That's what it seems like up in this area. Again, here's the comparison. Um, so I'm wondering if maybe this is just a, a normal flight pattern that this plane takes or if they've been monitoring Yellowstone with this plane for a long time or maybe even practiced for now. I mean, we all know there's a lot more activity going on at Yellowstone. Um, I'm currently digging into that stuff, so I don't have a lot of information on that for you right now. But again, this was just a quick update. Um, I hope this reaches Mr. MBB333. I wish there was an easier way to say his name. But um, yeah, guys, this is it. It seems to me that they've been doing this flight pattern for a while, or they've been monitoring, monitoring this area for a while. And I just found that interesting. A lot of people were pointing out how it was flying in a sort of pentagram type deal. <laughs> but um, anyway, guys, that's it for now. Um, I'll be back with some more videos shortly, later on today. And that's it. Talk to you guys soon. Bye-bye. And real quick, guys, I should have put this in the beginning of the video, but just a quick recap of what Sophia is. Now, Sophia is a, a NASA-owned uh, converted Boeing 747 that they uh, gutted out and put a German-built telescope in it, an infrared telescope. Um, and this plane flies at about 39,000 to 45,000 feet. And what this does is it brings it above um, infrared blocking water vapor that's in our, our skies. So it rises above that so we can get clearer shots into space. Now that's what they claim it's for. But according to Mr. MBB33, who I highly recommend you go to to get more information on this plane. He's been, like I said, been doing amazing work on this stuff. Very detailed work. You can learn a lot from this guy. Um, and yeah, that's basically it. Um, it's, I believe it's 80% owned by NASA, 20% owned by the Germans. Uh, again, it's a German scope and they fly way high up in the sky to get those clear shots. So that's what NASA tells us Sophie is for. But again, we, a lot of us are noticing that it's monitoring, uh, ground stuff. Um, I know there was a, a magma chamber or something like that found underneath Yellowstone. I'm not sure what year that was. So, again, that could be why they, uh, in 2014, they showed that flight path. Anyway, guys, that's it for now. Um, I'm going to be doing more research on this stuff. And, again, I'll be following Mr. MBB333, who's been covering this real closely. All right, guys, thanks again. Bye-bye.